Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing a really requested video. Um, it is a video on how I do my halo eyes. So this is a look that I'm going to recreate. Um, well not recreate, well I'm going to do. <laughs> and um, yeah, and, and a lot of people ask me how I get, like you know, how I do my halo eyes. Um, but it's one of the most, like the ones that I have the most trouble with is halo eyes. Halo eyes and eyeliners on the top of your lid. Unless it's glitter. I've gotten really good at glitter because it's not really like precise. But like what's like white eyeliner or any type of colored eyeliner on the top is just... I can't do it. it I have a shaky hand and I suck. So um, I've been working on both my halo and my eyeliner looks. And I feel like my halo eye has gotten a lot better. Um actually recorded like three times a halo look and I just hated it so this one you guys it, it made the cut because it's super cute I don't know if you guys can tell but I'm freaking obsessed not so much with the face makeup but um you know I was really just going for focusing on the eyes um but yeah you guys so if you guys want to know how to achieve this look just keep on watching okay to begin with the eyelids I'm gonna go in the Tarte Shape Tape concealer color sand no it's light sand sorry and I'm just gonna use that as a base and it is a lot lighter than my actual color but that's so that it'll actually pop out and I'm just gonna use a flat brush to um, set that all over the eye We're not going to set the eye just because we really do want the color to pop out. So we're going to be going in only the Modern Renaissance palette. And I'm going to go in Burnt Orange. And I'm going to be using a brush number 8 from BH Cosmetic. And this is what it looks like. And now with a BH Cosmetics brush number V5, this is what it looks like. And I'm going to go in with that same burnt orange color, tap off excess, and now blend it out. Okay, now with that real gar, I believe that's how you say it, it's that darker orange. Um, I'm going to go in with a NYX brush, and this is what the brush looks like. I'm just going to pack that in towards, like, the corners. With a clean fluffy brush, I'm going to go over on the edges. Okay, now we're going to go in Cypress Umber. Yeah, Cypress Umber. And we're going to pack that also in the outer corners. And we're going to...
Now with the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in Light Sand, I'm just going to use a small brush. This is from Real Techniques. It's a um, detailer brush. I'm going to do the cut crease. Okay, now for the um, halo, we're going to use Primavera, and I'm going to use a flat brush, but I'm only going to go in the middle, not on the outer edges. I'm going to blend out the brown color first. So this is a finished look. I really, 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 really liked how my eyes came out. I have a lot of trouble with halo and like top eyeliner looks. Um, so I've been trying to practice some more on them. But I feel like my halo eye came out so bomb. Um, not so much the face. Uh, I feel like I went a little too dramatic on it, but it's okay. Oh, well. Um, but like I said, I hope you guys really enjoyed this um, video, and I hope it helped you guys kind of see how I achieve my halo looks. Hopefully, we can both get a lot better in halo eyes um, in the near future. <laughs> so if you guys did like this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.